this is the review of the ASAP launcher. Are you tired of that grid design on your Android phone? Yeah, sorry Apple users, you're gonna sit this one out. Say no more to ASAP, but what is ASAP? Does it bring anything new? You may be asking, well, let's take a look and find out. ASAP aims to be simple, fast and clutter free so that you can get the task done at hand more quickly. So what does it bring to the table? Well it brings a whole lot of speed for sure, swiping through your home screens through the different cards. This launcher is a snap to use. You swipe left or right to get to your cards which consists of contacts, calendar, weather and a to-do list. If you're wondering if you can add more cards, you do not add more because it might cause the app to slow down which is not the aim of this launcher. Moving on to the contacts card, the, ca the contact card is basically a list of contacts and you can change that list to show all contacts, frequent contacts, recent and start contacts. It's a pretty basic card. This card allows for access of a phone dialer, a shortcut to the full contacts app and a well-placed new contacts button. Moving on, the weather card uses your location to get the most up-to-date data from weathermap.org and then displays this information beautifully which you can see as in clean icons as in clouds and rain and whatnot. It also shows if it's day or night by the background being light or dark. Moving on to the calendar card, the calendar card shows an event that is in your calendar account and you have the option to show which calendar you want to show on this list. You also have the option to add events and a shortcut to the main calendar app on your phone. The last card is the to-do list card. This provides you with a list and then you can make a list on top of that list which you can add items to. So basically you can create multiple lists and switch accordingly to your heart's desire as seen here. On to the main course of this app, the home screen. What is it? Well, it's simple really. You got frequent apps to the bottom which you can store up to 12 at a time. Most of the time you will see 4 apps to the bottom of your screen and you have to swipe up or press the home button again and you will see the remaining 8 apps. Swiping from left to right of the edge of the screen gives you access to a list of all the apps you got installed. And you can even choose to hide apps that you don't want to see. Uninstall and app info options are also available when you hold on the specific app which is super awesome. There is even a handy alphabet list where you can also scroll by the letter which is very handy for fast app finding. To the top of the home screen guys, you got a Google Now voice mic where you can do some handy Google searches and next to that is the date and time. Underneath that is the weather and I don't think there is anything else on this widget but you can swipe up and hide the widget to show a handy clock. Swiping from the right guys gives you a quick settings bar which is like the pull down menu bar um, on your Android phone but is much quicker. You can customize the order and which settings you want to display. I find myself really using this because I was accustomed to the pull down menu already. So guys that's it for the home screen. So this app is free after all. Always to use most of the app great features comes with a cost and that cost is no notification badges, no icon packs, no screen rotate and no custom team colors. Thankfully the app is cheap but still can be a deal breaker of some. Wrapping up this review, ASAP is a fast, easy and simple Android launcher. Look no further for any less. With no bloatware, this is one of the cleanest launchers I've seen in 2016 so far. I recommend you download it and try it and see for yourself. The link is down below and while you're there, um, please subscribe for more app reviews and have a good day.